Hi everyone, it's once again Billy Potent ZYC. Today I wanted to show you guys a few of the things that I just purchased on Amazon from again Exoterra. I love the guys. Um, the main thing that I am really excited about is the new Reptile UVB 200 light. It is the intense UVB, their strongest compact UVB light on the market right now. Um, currently, I don't know if you guys can really see, but I'll tell you. Um, it is really best at about 20 centimeters, which is 8 inches distance. It has the highest output then, but it still pretty much holds up okay at 12 to 16 inches. Um, I'm not really worried about that because Rocky's tank is 18 inches deep, so um, that will work perfectly fine. Currently, I've been using the 10 UVB Repti Glow Exoterra Light. This is the one that I'll be using for my crested geckos and I supplement them also with the natural light 26 watt um, which really does stimulate plant growth I had wonderful results inside of my uh, Jackson's chameleon enclosure the plant the hibiscus plant that I bought in Home Depot has been growing exceptionally well even when I cut, trim it and cut it up it grows right back very beautifully um, what I also have purchased them is the Exoterra small compact top from time to time I do like to refresh them so in order for you guys to see how it looks like this is again the Crest the Gecko setup but they're right now running the Reptiglow 10 UVB in the back and in the front I have two natural lights so three lights running at the very moment you see very nice light distribution uh, guys are really relaxing right up here on the top right um, so very nice light output again crested geckos they don't like too much heat and so the UVB one I do turn off from time to time but I will leave them with the natural light um, in order to see the action of the reptile UVB 200 UVB intense let's go up to the second floor where Rocky is enjoying himself and right now he's basking under the UVB 200 light bulb which you guys can see up there in the back on the right uh, on the left is the natural light uh, in the front I still kept two old natural lights um, he also has the Zoomed um, Sun power sunlight which I turn off from time to time and um, to give him some extra heat it's a combo of three lights so he has a nice light source heat and UVB so so for some of you guys who really don't have too much space this 3-in-1 light bulb does the trick I also purchased the new Exoterra Sunray sadly the ones that they sent to me a was not working and they sent me the 50 watt bulb but in my next review that's what I'm going to try to show you guys and do a comparison between this Power Sun from Zoomed and this new Exoterra Sunray so once again this is how the new light setup works and looks like on both the crested gecko and the bearded dragon setup. Take care guys.